What is going on guys? It's Blue Deep Dive here and welcome to another 2v2 tournament. As I'm recording this right now, there is no custom game, so it was very very difficult to record these matches, so I was only able to get two out of the three. Um, but I still felt that they should be posted. These are some good matches and you know anybody that wins one of my tournaments definitely deserves that spotlight and with multiverse is taking a break for now I think it's a good time to bring you guys some multiverses while you're waiting and here is the first match we have team venomous against team umberkins very interesting choices I really like um, on team venomous how you have Velma doing damage from far away and then you got Finn up in your face so you got the Finn doing the 1v2 and then getting bombarded by Velma's uh, you know, damage from long range. I like that. And the Light Bulb 2 is a very good finisher. On the other end, we have Umberkins with uh, Batman here doing a lot of damage. And then, oh, he's got, almost got elimination. Umberkins almost got I'm so washed. Oh, that was very, very close right there. Oh, and Finn. Oh, Venomous and I'm so washed both. Barely escaping eliminations here. Oh, they got elimination. I think he just ran out of jumps right now. They juggled them very well. Very good teamwork from Team Venomous. They weren't able to get Umberkins there. It looked like they weren't expecting that kill. And that they didn't follow up on uh, Umberkins. I thought they thought maybe he was going to survive there. But the damage is going pretty high up there as Team Venomous is getting close to 100 plus damage per character here. I think if you're uh, Venomous, you kind of have the lead right now. Because even though you're probably going to lose it, you can do, do just do damage before you get eliminated to set up the next kills. If you're a team Umberkins, you got to eliminate them as soon as possible. Like right there. And they got the lead. They got high damage, so they really got to like double team one person to really make the most of the situation. Because they're above 100, so they really need to stay alive. And probably do some edge guarding here. Get a quick elimination. Because if they don't, it's going to be in uh, Team Venomous's favor, actually. You know, so much is going on right now. So we have Batman right here. Umberkins, oh, getting eliminated. Very nice teamwork. Ooh, I'm barely able to get out of the way. Zero 2XL. Notice how important it is not to get eliminated right there. And he is over 132 damage. Oh my gosh, the cop, guys. The cop car, oh, got destroyed. You know... It used to be when the cop car came out, it was just GG, but people have been destroying it. It's pretty crazy and avoiding it as well. But right now, Team Venomous are uh, very close to winning this, but Umberkins does have a fair shot if uh, Zero 2 xl can get the elimination off uh, Venomous and make it a 3-3 evenly. So we'll, we'll see what happens. You know, Venomous is just doing combo city right now. Oh, Umberkins to the rescue. He's going to try to get this elimination. Oh, and somehow Venomous just staying alive. Oh, and the cop car. Something happened to the cop car, and it's even right now. It's anybody's game. Will be Team Venomous, will be Team Umberkins. You know, if I'm uh, Team Umberkins, I go after that Velma. It's the highest damage so far, at 59. And you gotta put pressure, too. If, uh, if I'm so washed, I see a lot of Velmas play Keep Away with the flashlight and do the lightning bolt. Uh, the light bulb. Oh, oh! I was studying right there, because Venomous almost got eliminated. My gosh, that damage right there could have ended the match, but interrupted the combo. So many people are above 100. All this mayhem, and somehow Venomous taking the first match. What a victory right there. Put your thoughts in the comments, guys. Who do you think is going to win this match? I mean, it was a very, very close first match here. So we're going to be going into the second one, and let's see what happens. Welcome back, guys. We have here the second match. As it seems like both teams will be going the same characters. I did allow a uh, character change, but not many people have been taking advantage of that. You know, when someone sticks to their teamwork and uh, how they're going to move and combos for certain characters, it's understandable. But let me know, guys. Let me know your thoughts below who's going to win this second match here. You know, so much was happening in the last match. I mean, I almost missed that last kill. I saw it in the corner of my eye. I mean, once you get over 100 damage, like, you could blow on someone or throw a toothpick and they're, they're, they're out of there, guys. All right, here we are at the start of the second match. We're going to be in uh, Scooby's Haunted Mansion. Believe it or not, losing team does pick the stage. Wanted to set that up correctly in my tournaments. I uh, didn't do that prior before, but here we go, guys. It's going to be a huge factor because we have these traps here in the bottom. 
see if teams take advantage when people get high on damage where if you open the bottom trap you can do insane juggles even insane juggles with the wall and the ceiling here I think Jake has some good opportunities for like the slam and the double uh, uppercut in the air oh man Finn looks crazy with the giant head the Velma Jake is a good duo here, but uh, Batman is even more scary with these uppercuts. Oh, he almost took out Venomous. You know, this is one of Batman's best stages, to be honest. The Batarangs and the uppercuts are pretty insane, and it's taking its toll on I'm So Wash. It's getting very close to getting eliminated. Oh, some teamwork right here, and there it is, guys. That, uh, that uppercut from Batman. Umbrican's taking that advantage for that uppercut. He's putting himself in danger here. I'm not sure if that was a baited switch. But we have here Velmo with the light bulb. Oh, faking that he's in danger with 100% damage to the lightning bulb. Very nasty right there for Limeso Wash. Playing dirty, but you gotta play dirty in my tournaments, guys. If you're not playing to win, you're not playing at all. And a big knuckle sandwich right there from Z from zero to XL. Oh, they're in they're in trouble right there. Team Umberkins was in the center of the stage together. You gotta want to spread out there sometimes when you're too um, different in damage. You know, Umberkins is being a beast right now, being a huge problem, but you know, Team Venomous sticking to their strategy with uh, Venomous going out there and I'm so washed trying to do damage from far away, but Umber Umberkins can see the strategy. Oh, I don't know guys, I don't know how Zero 2 XL survived from that. He got a sword right to the face on the edge, kind of an edge guarding. Oh, he dropped that, uh, that, that ceiling combo. Oh, very nice boat and very nice elimination from I'm so washed. You know, I'm trying to look at both battles. You got two 1v1s, one on the left side, one on the right. But uh, as soon as the elimination happened... Oh, the cop car is coming into play. Oh, crazy elimination, guys, from Team Venomous right there. You know, I looked at the elimination, and I look in the middle, and the cop car is already gone. You know, so much is happening right now. You know, there's an art to 2v2s. Oh, somehow! Nope, not that time. Venomous definitely died from that uppercut from a McKenz. Oh, I think maybe... um. Umberkins is trying to go after that Velma. Could get an elimination to seal the deal on the second match here. Bring it to a match three. But I don't know. You know, Venomous is dealing a lot of damage to Zero on this 1v1 here. Oh, he's trying to trying to get that last elimination. Both teammates working really hard to get the I'm so washed. I'm so washed barely getting out of there. Oh, and that nasty Yuppie. spike to the ground. Nasty sort of death from Venomous. It's going to seal the deal for the best two out of three. And they will be going to the finals. What a crazy match guys and I'll see you in a bit.